Mark, first of all, just before NBAA 2012 gets rolling, we had a couple things we wanted to catch up with you on. Let's first do an overview of what's happening with your G1000 King Air Retrofit program. The G1000 Retrofit for the King Air is going remarkably well. Um, we've done uh, right now our 75th G1000 installation, and that's roughly over three years. So the market acceptance of this product is just phenomenal. We've done more than half of these worldwide. We're definitely the leading installer in this. And it's just a fantastic product. The customers love it. The first customers that ever bought it still come back to me and say it was the best decision they ever made. I see you're talking about 15 days of downtime. This is a big job for 15 days. Who are you kidding here? Come on now. That's what a lot of people think is that we're kidding people. So what we did is we just put a financial guarantee behind it. $1,000 a day for any day we go over. And the 15, all of our customers are a reference for us. And they will attest that we do these jobs in 15 days. It's a very well thought out process. In some regards, consider it almost an assembly line type process of bringing these airplanes through. All the parts and components are built before the airplane comes in. We have our own wire harness fabrication shops. And then we have different teams, teams of incoming inspection teams. Then we have the interior teams that disassemble the airplanes. Then we have the removal teams that remove all the equipment, then reinstallation. Then we have checkout teams and flight tests. And it's a very well orchestrated process that we can guarantee this 15 day downtime. How many thousand dollars a day have you, have you paid out? Up till now, none. That's what I wanted to hear. <laughs> what kind of feedback are you getting from the end user? They're ecstatic with the operation of it. They love it. And maybe two weeks or a month or maybe six months after I'd call them back after they have it. It's all, did you know it did something like that? And just that excitement. It's just a great product to sell. What's a typical installation like this go for? What kind of investment is somebody going to be putting into to upgrading their King Air? Well, it, it depends a little bit upon when I talked about trading credits and what the value of the equipment's worth and this and that. But generally, uh, the C90s are going to be your King Air C90s are going to be your lower costs. And then they go up roughly, you know, they're three hundred dollars to $350,000 installed is a good number. That's a lot of capability for the airplane. It is a tremendous when you're considering, for lack of better words, this is zero time avionics here. From the wiring to all the components, everything's replaced. You don't have the ongoing maintenance that you would with your existing avionics and uh, all the problems that go with it, beyond all the uh, functionality enhancements. It's all around a great product. Aero TV is brought to you by Renbird Flight Simulations is dedicated to revolutionizing flight training by designing, manufacturing, and delivering affordable and innovative flight training technologies. Each Renbird device is designed to enhance the training experience for pilots of all levels, from student to ATP. Redbird is quickly becoming the industry standard for flight training. Since Redbird introduced its revolutionary FMX in 2007, colleges, universities, and flight training operations around the world have integrated Redbird products into their curriculum. It's time to discover what Redbird can do for you. Join the migration.